Hello friends. Today we are going to discuss one methods for screening of antidepressant activity in the drug that is despair swim test. Now what is this test? Let's see. It was first described by Horsold et al. in 1977 and 1978. Mice or rats are used in the screening methods and they are forcefully allowed to swim into a restricted space or restricted area from which they cannot escape from outside. During this period, it induces a characteristic behavior of immobility into the animal and the animal shows a floating posture. This behavior reflects a state of despair which can be reduced by several clinically effective antidepressant drugs. Now here in this procedure we have to use one container or it is also called as vertical flexiglass cylinder and the height of the cylinder is 40 centimeter, the diameter of the cylinder is 18 centimeter and for rat and mice the dimension is varies this is for rat then to this cylinder up to 15 centimeter fill this cylinder with uh, water and the temperature of that water should be maintained up to 25 degree centigrade rats or mice are used for this test and when the rats are put into the cylinder immediately it shows the mobility including the highly active posture then the rat or mice try to escape from the surrounding space and they shows vigorous swimming this is the stage of mobility one has to observe this stage for five to six minutes. So initially for two to three minutes, the animal shows high mobility, but after some time, the mobility reaches a plateau where the animal remain immobilized for, for approximately 80% of the time. This is what the posture where the animals are immobile, the posture is uh, here, the nose is just uplifted, the animal is floating and at this, play, at this time, the 80% of the time spent by the animal is like this, it is called as the immobility and one has to consider this immobility timing in the animal. Now observe this for 5 to 6 minutes. And then after 15 minutes, you remove the animals and put the animals onto the heater where it maintains the temperature of 32 degree centigrade. Now, by this way, uh, test standard as well as the control group has to uh, use. Each group is divided into six animals. The control animal don't inject any type of drugs and observe the duration of mobility, swimming and climbing. Then administer standard as well as the test drug half an hour or one hour prior to this test depending on the nature of the drug. And then similarly the observation is carried out, the compare the result which gives you the idea about antidepressant activity. If the drug having good antidepressant activity, it will significantly alter the duration of immobility, swimming and climbing. This method is sensitive to a large number of atypical antidepressant drugs which are
Sampai